Today we are celebrating the third annual Denver Day of Service in partnership with Mile High United Way and the Denver Broncos. Across the entire metro region, today will feature 33 different projects, both in person and remote, and will host 390 volunteers, all giving back to their community in really tangible and impactful ways. The economic impact of today's volunteer hours will reach nearly $30,000, and we couldn't do it alone. We believe in the power of partnership, and the 20 nonprofit partners that are working together today across all of these different initiatives are really feeling the value uh, of our community and what we can do together. We are doing a food donation drive for the Help and Hope Center. We made um, plans for peanut butter, cereal, water, um, washing things like soap and laundry and household cleaners, um, diapers, feminine hygiene products. and. That, those were the things that were the highest on the list, and so that's what people um, we requested they bring. Packing bags, packing bags, trying to help feed some people in our community. And uh, it's a great thing just having so many wonderful people here in the building helping out who is willing to you know, put their time into helping those who are less fortunate. We're joined by President and CEO Joe Ellis, General Manager George Payton, Senior Vice President of Strategic Initiatives Brittany Bolin, as well as our ticket office staff and Denver Broncos cheerleaders. Here at Mile High United Way, we are making no-sew blankets as a part of our community baby shower. We know moms and new families need so many things to get on the right foot, including diapers and wipes and formula. And the volunteers that are making these no-sew blankets today will add another piece of warmth and comfort to new families and new babies that are coming into the world. It's one of many days that are important in terms of what we do in the community, but uh, it's nice. It's kind of the culmination, or maybe it's even the start of the year for us where we get out into the community in various areas and make a difference. It feels really good. You know, I've only been to the stadium one other time, and so just to, to be here with all the people and everyone working you know, for one common goal, it's, it's just great to be out there and, and having a really good time doing it. We partnered with U.S. Hunger uh, to work together to package 17,500 meals that will be distributed to local food pantries in Colorado. You know, I think we're building a tradition with Denver Day of Service, and it allows us to engage so many parts of our business and community. You know, we have representatives from football, we have representatives from our community development, and we have representatives from our business side, all working together here today. And then we're also engaging our season ticket holders, our fans, and our community. And it really builds that full circle picture of bringing everyone together around a common cause um, to engage you know, Denver and give back to Denver and our community in a really awesome way. Denver Broncos' relationship with Mile High United Way is so important because we can't do this work alone. Mile High United Way works incredibly hard to coordinate all of the logistics of these projects alongside our 20 nonprofit partners and beneficiaries. Every project will feel special in its own unique way, but collectively, knowing that there are 33 projects happening at the same time across the city um, is a really, really special feeling.